Geek Street Discs. Oh, God. <laughs> Are you recording? Yeah. Come on. Hey. Hey, welcome to Geek Street Discs After Dark. Yeah, this is uh, put away the children, put away your wives. No, just kidding. It's not going to be that bad. I'm Mark. This is Andy. Uh, we had uh, a lot of discs come in today, and so we just wanted to review with uh, all of our customers out there uh, what we got in. Uh, I do want to remind you that we still have some pro pigs in hashtag less doink more oink. So make sure if you haven't done so yet, uh, come in and get your Ricky Wasaki pigs. They're flying off the shelves, but fortunately we we stocked enough. Hopefully we can make it through the weekend. The pigs are flying. They are. It's true. So it's time. Okay. So uh, so what do we got? Uh, so one of the things that we got is uh, we got the new. Jen Allen Glow T-Bird. Uh, so if you don't have a T-Bird in your bag, then why uh, not? Uh, but the other thing is this is one of the Tour Series discs, so every disc that you buy actually supports the, um, the Innova Pro, in this case, Jen Allen. We have another uh, Pro disc uh, from Innova, the TL3, which is uh, Mason Ford's disc. That's a nice, uh, I think it's an eight-speed disc. Uh, it's they're all white, but not glow. So don't uh, get the impression that they're glow. So all you dyers out there, this is a great base to start with. There you go. We got a fresh load of uh, Joel Freeman Gator threes, which is a uh, great uh, mid range for you. Yeah, cool disc. Then uh, we're gonna wor work our way over here. So as many of you all know, disc scratch is very hard to come by. We only get so much in. Uh, but we happen to get some in today. Uh, we got some uh, Maltas, uh, a nice little overstable mid-range. We got the Page Pure Souls, another. Uh, this is an understable mid-range for you. Uh, we got some uh, zones. zones, a great overstable putt and approach disc. I personally bag one of those. We got a few Hades, but as you can see, we're already down to only two. So if you want one, you better hurry. They are flying off the shelves. And then we also got some Z Plastic Heats, uh, which is a fun little disc that you need to have in your bag as well. So um, so that's all of the disc craft that we got. Now we're going to move down this way to the... We do actually have some just plain old R-Pro uh, pigs. But again, uh, if you buy one of those, uh, Ricky Wasaki gets nothing. Yeah. So keep that in mind. So going down here to Castaplast, we got a little bit of Castaplast in, and again, uh, we got quite a few Bergs, but as you can see, there's only two left. Yeah. So if you like your Bergs, uh, you might want to hurry up and get here for that. We did get a new order of Cac-Z's in. Again, this is another, this is a great disc. I have this in my bag. It's a six-speed um, overstable mid-range. Flies straight, and it gives you that fade at the end. It's a great disc. Um, it's in K1 uh, soft plastic, uh, great plastic. We also got some rasks in, including a get out of jail free foil stamp uh, rask. So if you uh, need a nice distance driver with a nice little uh, uh, groove on the underside, then the rask is a good disc to use. And, and if you're unlikely to end up in jail, then this one doesn't have anything on it. <laughs> it's right. It's, it's complete. That's for the people out there who actually obey the law. Yeah. Um, so I think that's all of the castoplast we got. Yes, it is. So let's make our way over here. Um, we got uh, a new uh, putter in. It's new to us. It's not a new putter. It's actually, I'm not even quite sure how much, uh, how many of the whales they're making these days, but this is done in the Ken Climo plastic, the KC Pro plastic. Um, that one's killer. It, <laughs> it is. It is a killer whale. So uh, those are fun. Uh, uh, it's uh, got a small little bead on it. So if you like a uh, putter with a little bit of bead, uh, then the whale is the way to go. Good throwing putter. Um, so uh, if, you, if you want something to, uh, to use off the tee on a short uh, par three type hole, then give the KC whale a, a try. The, the other thing that we've done, and uh, this is I think the 27th manufacturer that we now have in the store, it's a new company from Norway. I don't know what it is about those Scandinavians, but they love their disc golf. Uh, it's a company called Suna Sport, and uh, they make uh, these interesting discs that are, um, this is actually called their safety line plastic, so they're good for beginners, 
They're also good catch and throw discs, and they're also good if you want to make a taco. So you can make a taco with it. And um, but these are a fun little discs. They're very flat. Um, we they, haven't tried them out yet. They float. They, and they do float. So great to use at the beach. So we got a couple molds of uh, of those, and then they also have a different plastic. This is what's called their S plastic, um, and we have a mid range and a driver and a fairway driver uh, in uh, in this S plastic from uh, Sune Sport. So you might want to come and check these out. It's an interesting plastic. It feels a little bit like a slick DX, maybe, yeah, with a little bit a little um, pro in it or something. Yeah, with a, maybe a little bit more of a bendy flight plate than that what you see in DX. But also very lightweight. Very lightweight, yes. So, uh, so an interesting a new addition uh, to our lineup here at Yeet Street. Um, so, then we also oh also you you probably already saw the announcement, but the the Royal Rides are out. Um, and of course, we've got the figs and uh, some voodoo's in the 4S. We've got that super stupid silly soft, uh, and we've got some in the uh, regular uh, triple S. Well, yeah, triple S uh, and super soft. Um, so yeah, we've got those. And for all of you Odin sons out there who who have the arm for it, we've got a fresh load of Thor. Whoever thought, whoever would have thought that we would have sold out of a 14 speed disc, but yeah. we did. Yeah. Uh, but we got new ones in uh, and these actually look kind of sweet. They look kind of like a melon rind. Um, so this is in their um, premium plastic, uh, armor plastic. Uh, but we also got some in the, in the um, cheaper plastic. Um, uh, actually, this is the armor plastic right here. This is their, I can't remember Storm. the premium. Storm plastic, thank you. Yeah. Um, and we also got some in the ground plastic, which is their cheaper plastic. So uh, whatever version you like, we got plenty more Thors back in. And we've got various wizards. We've got some in the special blend. Uh, we've got the wizard in the, uh, yeah, that's special blend as well. We yeah. also have the uh, super stupid silly soft uh, wizards. Now, now some people are probably wondering what special blend? I am too. <laughs> so uh, something that Gateway does is they like to experiment with the different blends and they will actually take um, some polymers that they get from other companies and can kind of uh, combine them. Uh, and they, I think they've done this like 30 times. So they're looking for that perfect special blend that they can make um, uh, a permanent blend and they think that this is it. So it's kind of neat. Uh, it's an interesting texture. You're not gonna feel anything like it before. And again, if you don't know anything about Gateway Putters, um, the Wizard is one of the most popular putters out there. So uh, they also make the Voodoo, which is a really good putter. So if you're looking at trying out a new putter, try the Voodoo, try the Wizard. You can't go wrong. People who use Gateway Putters really love them, so they must know something. We also got the uh, Gateway Element in. Um, that's a, uh, a nice uh, stable mid-range for you. That's in the diamond plastic, so we got a lot of those. And we also got some, I don't see them up here, do we have the spears? So the spears, we got the uh, hyper diamond spears. Yeah, we got the spears. Th these aren't just diamonds, these are hyper diamond spears. So, uh, I mean, if diamond is the hardest substance in the world, hyper diamond is out of this world. Harder than the harder, I don't know what you would do with hyper diamond, yeah. but. Um, so anyways, we're pretty excited. We've got a bunch of stuff in, um, even though suppliers are, uh, let's face it, they're being a little, uh, they're being a little, yeah, a little stingy with the uh, supplies, but um, somehow uh, we managed to keep finding um, um, uh, discs to stock the store with so that you guys here in the Triangle have um, a lot of selection and a lot of choices to choose from. That's our goal is that no matter what disc you like, hopefully you can find it here. So come on down. Uh, like I said, hopefully the R Ricky Wasaki pigs are going to make it through the weekend, but we don't know if they are or not. So make sure you get down here and get yours if you haven't yet. There, we're currently not having any limits on, on consumers, but if somebody walked in and said, I want 15, we may have to question your uh, uh, sanity at that point. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, but come on down. Uh, we'd love to see you here. Um, it's going to be a great weekend to play disc golf. And so make sure you start your weekend off right by stock, stocking your bag with all the discs that you might need and uh, get you a taco disc, maybe. Yeah. We open up tomorrow at 10. So you kind of pause there. You're not sure when we. 
Well, I wasn't sure what tomorrow was. Of course, you're not going to be here tomorrow because you're going to be an exciting uh, clover, clover, South Carolina. Carolina. That's, so. Nothing says more excitement more than clover does. Yeah, yeah. So, so uh, and, and if you come in tomorrow and you're like, hey, where did all the gateway discs go? Well, we had so many of them, we moved them to their own section in the back, yeah. in the so back you, of the house. You can see way, way back there in the back, that's, that's our new gateway wall. So. Yeah. Anyways, also be on the lookout that um, MVP has finally got their ordering system uh, online. Uh, they haven't actually let us order anything yet, but we're hoping by on the 25th, we're going to be able to order more uh, Axiom, more MVP, and more Streamline, which is pretty darn exciting because I know you guys love your MVP discs. So look for that next week. Um, obviously, we'll announce it on social media when that happens. Um, and we've got some other stuff coming uh, here in a little bit too, and we'll be sure to let you all know when that comes in. So, But until then, happy hucking. Have fun out there in the course, and we hope to see you in here soon. Yep. Bye.